Hello, today we're back at Orange Bricks with Marcos, and I have got this mock kind of build I made, inspired from the Force Awakens. And when I was at the beach a couple months ago, I brought back some sand, and I didn't know what to do with it, but the first thing that came to mind would be a build, and... I was thinking of making a Harry Potter build with the sand, but I couldn't really think of anything but Expecto Patronum, but I was missing Sirius Black, which is my favorite Harry Potter character. Anyway, this is when the Star Destroyer, that is a mini Star Destroyer I made, I'll just pull that out. This mini Star Destroyer here I made, and I got kind of inspired to build something else with it. I know this side isn't identical with this side, but I don't care because one half of the half of the thing is just shoved in the sand, so not really doesn't really bother me at all. This brick isn't even on properly, but I don't care because it's shoved in the sand, and yeah. <laughs> Around it, I've got uh, some fires. I've got some Lego pieces as sand by there as well. Right here, I'm not sure if you could see, but you've got some bones sticking out from some sort of animal. There's actually some sand under here that's making some funny noise. Um, but I've got this um, helmet piece from one of the Ninjago sets. Actually came in a lot of the sets. But, yeah, um, I got some trees. This is miniature scale. You can call this remote control if you want. I don't know but it's intentionally supposed to be a um, mini scale build. And yes, this is real sand. And am I gonna add water to this? Uh, no, because it's gonna destroy everything here. And I was gonna build a miniature mi Millennium Fa Falcon, but I'm really bad at building things like that, so I didn't bother. Here is one other scene I made. This one is from the Clone Wars. And these minifigures, or I guess one minifig and two battle droids, I got, or I won from ANA Hobbies. I got the AAT, the Armored Assault Tank with them. So they came with the Armored Assault Tank. Though, um, I did a video on uh, reviewing that, but anyway, here is this mock I made. Well, it's more of a sandy mock, I should say. Now there's sand everywhere all over the place because I can spilt some. I moved around the fires and I um, this is not separate. I just ripped this Star Destroyer out of the last one I made. And you got some skull from Ninjago there. A sword for another wooden sword from Ninjago. This is Ahsoka's trooper. And I spread out some fire. Got two battle droids. Not sure where that guy's shooting, but you could tell that that one's shooting there. And this one is telling this one with his arm to shoot there because he's just shooting over there. That is pretty random. Unless there is a Star Destroyer over here, but they're on the same team or different time or whatever. Anyway. Yeah. Here is this one I made. And I really, I'm not sure if I like this one or the last one better. Hmm. 
will have to think about that. And here is Wonder Woman's invisible jet. No, just kidding. No, um, I'm gonna build a Superman one next. Here is the Superman one I made, not the invisible jet, but the Superman one. I, c I made a mock that kind of relates to this when he goes down and punches at the ground and then the ground falls apart. But since here you can't really tell that the ground's not even unless you look like that there or something. But I added some fires around the thing. Try not to get his cape sandy, but the Superman I did get from the DC collectible series, and I used this to dig the hole, this um, helicopter fuselage, and got some fires around it. I put, and but one thing I noticed is if you leave it like this for a little while, he kind of sinks into the sand. Because with the Star Destroyer I had, this one, um, he, it, well, it sank into the sand and I kind of had to pull it out. Anyway, comment down below which one you think is your favorite. The first one, the second one, the third one, the third one is Wonder Woman's Invisible Jet, which was nothing. Or the fourth one. No, just kidding, not to make it confusing. Uh, comment down below which mock was your favorite. Mine was probably the first one. And you're not allowed commenting Wonder Woman's Invisible Jet. That's it for this build. Thank you for watching today's video. Hope you enjoyed. And I've been uploading lots of train videos. Comment down below if you like my train videos. I do. Anyway, thank you for watching today's video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share below. And see you next time. Bye for now.